Well, Clem, thanks for joining us. It could have been so much more, really, more than one goal this evening. Yeah, we, sh we showed a bit of quality at times. Uh, obviously, the boys are still getting up to their uh, match fitness that they need. They're still working hard at that. They're working hard on the training ground and then obviously coming in to play the games. Um, so it's a tough time for any player in pre-season. Uh, but the boys have, have uh, managed to win the game tonight and played some good football. As you say, they could have had a few more goals. Yeah, certainly controlled it in the second half. Mansfield just couldn't get anywhere near Jakubovic's goal, could they? No, I thought after the first sort of 20, 25 minutes, I thought we passed the ball very well. It was, it was tough at first. Uh, they, they, they obviously snapped into tackles and made it difficult for us. Um, and as I say, the boys are still finding their feet physically. But once we got our rhythm and moved the ball a bit quicker, um, we made it difficult for them. And, and yeah, it would have been nice to score a few more, but we're, we're happy that most of the boys have got through it. Obviously, we've picked up another couple of knocks, which is disappointing for us. Um, but we, uh, we have to move on, and hopefully the boys aren't too serious. Yeah, we'll just talk about those knocks. Michael Dawson limping off in the first half. What's the situation with him? Uh, we, we don't know properly yet. Um, we'll obviously assess it in the morning but he's had a knock to his knee uh, so uh, the physios will look at that tomorrow and he'll possibly be going for a scan so uh, not great for us um, but we're fingers crossed it's nothing serious as I say. Yeah I know Debajo of course the news that he's out for a lengthy period of time how have the players reacted to that? Well we're all so desperately disappointed for him because he's such a great lad he's a really nice kid and he's worked so hard um, and he was so successful last year in the way we played and was, was a big member of our team. He's getting his chance in the Premier League and he has that in the first pre-season game. So we're very disappointed for him, but we'll all support him the best we can and we hope to see him back playing as soon as possible. Yeah, we'll move to a couple of positives. Peter Odenwingi, he got his debut tonight. What was the uh, managerial perspective of his performance? Well, Peter's obviously, we know he's, a, he's been a class Premier League player over the years, um, but we, we brought him in. Uh, we're going to have a look at him, see how he does. He's a great lad, really, really nice fella. Um, he showed bits of quality tonight, just with a couple of runs and a couple of through passes. Could have scored, um, hit the post. So he, he's definitely got quality, so we, we, we'll take a good look at him. And then from the veterans, we've got the youngsters as well who are just thriving at the moment, aren't they? And if one of them's gone and scored this evening as well. Well, Jared's done well. Obviously, he's got his, a, a bigger opportunity tonight. He's had some smaller ones from the bench for short periods of time. But he got a longer period today because of the injury to, to Dorse. And he, he acquitted himself very, very well. Uh, they, he's been training with us all pre-season, along with Josh Time and Greg Law and Greg Olley. They've been with us uh, regular from the start. And uh, they've done very, very, very well. It's a big step up for these boys to, to go and play in the Premier League. Uh, they know that but um, they're, they're certainly not doing themselves any, um, any harm at the moment. Yeah, and lastly, any expected changes for Saturday? Um, I, would have, I would have thought so. Obviously, we, 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 we're looking at the moment possibly to bring some of the under-21 players back from their pre-season tour because uh, we are very short in numbers at the moment. Um, obviously, will there be change? We'll have to assess the boys, the ones that are fit over the next couple of days, and we'll see what we play at, at the weekend. But we'll still have a team out there to go and take on Scunthorpe.